everyone, so today we're going to Soho. I've been editing in the house all day this morning, so I really just wanted to get out of the house and breathe in some fresh air. But before we go, I wanted to share my outfit of the day with you guys because when I'm outside, I can't really film myself. It's kind of weird because people look at you like you're crazy and um, I don't have anyone else to film my whole outfit. So I'm just going to do in the mirror right behind me. Alright, so for my makeup, I'll just list all the information down below so you can check that out right there. But my lipstick, which is the main focus of my look today, is Myth by Laura Mercier, which is a really nice matte lip color that I've been loving. And then um, for my coat, which is just black and uh, white, um, it's it's from Primark actually so really inexpensive it's really big and oversized but I'm really into that whole oversized look so I really love it and I've had it for a while but um, yeah it's Primark really simple and then underneath I'm just wearing this basic t-shirt it's also uh, from Primark and it's a boyfriend t-shirt also really loose and um, comfortable um, my necklace that I always wear, um, this one, I always wear that one, just gold. And then this long one, I actually don't know which, uh, where this is from. I think it was from H&M a really long time ago. Um, and then for my bag, I'm actually just carrying uh, my camera bag as my bag today because I just really didn't want to go through the hassle of bringing two bags, a normal bag and then also camera bag. So um, I'm just carrying my camera bag uh, today because um, I think it might rain today so I want my camera to be safe. Um, and then for my jeans, I'm just wearing um, Hollister. Hollister uh, dark skinny jeans and then for my shoes um, I'm just wearing my Steve Madden Trupa boots which are just black all right so I think that's it um, I'm gonna go head out now and grab some food because I'm actually really hungry so let's go do that I was walking down the boardwalk one day when I saw this pretty young girl coming my way. I was so I just got done shopping and I'm really hungry, so let's go find something to eat. I'm at the Wendy's right now trying to eat broccoli and cheddar, baked potato. The last time I had this was when I was really young, so I'm gonna see if it's still as good as I remember it to be. Time to eat. Big potato. Oh yeah, that definitely hits the spot. So I'm walking on Union Square right now and I'm going home and this is the first time I can vlog outside and I don't feel weird because everyone is holding a camera to their head so did some shopping and ate some dinner and now I'm just gonna go home and relax. And as I'm walking, I actually find my school. This is where I'm going to be having classes starting next Monday. So that's exciting. If the bus would move, <laughs> then you could actually see it. But yeah, this is Union Square. And I just live like two minutes away from here. So pretty cool. I'm exhausted. Um, I've been out for six hours walking around so pretty tired but I went to Whole Foods and I just got some stuff um, some women's hygiene stuff some ginger snap cookies I love ginger cookies 
and then I got myself a treat I just wanted to have something sweet so I got a piece of red velvet cake and then last but not least some water so yeah that's all I uh, got from Whole Foods all right so I got three things and of course they're all similar this is one of the tops. This is just a striped white, uh, blue and white top and just flowy and loose like I like all of my clothing. <laughs> so yeah, just bought that. And the reason I bought this is because I have it in gray, which I absolutely love. So I decided to get this color as well. And then I got a dark gray t-shirt, the same material but then with short sleeve so I can wear it with a cardigan. And then I got another striped shirt, also short sleeved, same material because if I like something, I get it in every single color. So, so, so far so good. The city is treating me well and there's a lot to do a lot to see there's a reason they call the city the city that never sleeps so you can never really get bored but one of the things that i didn't really realize that was gonna happen is um you start feeling a little bit lonely if you don't know anyone in the city and um luckily friends of mine have friends here in new york so um, I hope I can get in touch with some people so that I can start going out a little bit and just meeting new people because I think it's important when you move to a new country or a new place to meet some new people um, and really feel like a local or else it's still just as if you're a tourist and you want to really um, feel like you're a local so yeah. Um, it has been a little bit lonely being here by myself and not knowing anyone. But I also live with two really fun girls and they're around the same age as me. But because they work full time, I don't really get to see them that often. And I'm obviously not working because I'm not allowed to. Visa requirements. But next week I'll start classes at the New York Film Academy and then... Um, things will start to be a little bit more busy so I'm looking forward to that and I do have a boyfriend back home so we're gonna be doing long distance for three months but that's not that bad so we've been facetiming every day because I got my phone fixed with internet on it unlimited internet so um, we can talk anytime we want and yeah I think I'm gonna stop rambling now and eat my cake and lay in bed and relax maybe watch some Netflix because I love me some Netflix and um, I still have three seasons of Dexter to go I'm on season five now and yeah love that show didn't expect to love that show but I really like it so yeah I hope you guys enjoyed this video and if you want to see more of New York City and all my other videos to come please subscribe to this channel it would mean a lot to me and I'll see you guys next time bye